All right, I'm here at Clark Park, just outside the boathouse on the dock where the rowers row, and I'm going to test Chicago River for ammonia. Fairly simple process. Build a line. Rinse. Push out a tablet. Drop it in and wait for it to dissolve. This will take a while. So while I'm waiting for this tablet to dissolve, I'm going to go ahead and take care of some of my other tests. So I'm going to put this ammonia sample here in with the card that I'm going to use to compare and determine the ammonia concentration. So that's ammonia and nitrate working for me. I'll give my ammonia a few more shakes. You can already see that it's partially dissolved, but not quite there yet. Move right on to our phosphate test. Probably guess what we're gonna do at this stage. Uncap, fill, dump, rinse. Wire your tablet. As these tablets dissolve, they're going to react, and that reaction is going to produce a colored compound that will be in some way proportional to the concentration of our desired ion, be it ammonia, be it nitrate, be it phosphate. I guess I know ammonia is a mod, but our desired species. So as that reaction proceeds forward and produces the color change, we'll then compare the color to this standard. So. I'm going to do the pH 1 last because the pH 1 is going to occur the most quickly by far. I might as well have those other tests working for me while I'm doing my pH. pH directions are a bit more complicated, but in the end, I'm filling it with water, I'm adding 10 drops of indicator, and then I'm capping it, mixing it, and then comparing it. less dense than the water into which I put it. Agitate. And since this reaction has occurred very, very quickly, I can now compare it to my standard. Now, when you compare this to your standard, it is often preferable to have a nice solid white background against which to compare it. Luckily I've got some spare hands, or some spare paper. Showing them nice and clear. I will leave it to my viewing audience to ascertain the approximate value. If it is not exactly the same as any one color, it will be between two colors. You can surmise the extent to which it is that color or another color and you can assign the appropriate number of significant figures. I hope these words make sense to you.
Okay, Sechi turbidity test. Go for it. Until we can no longer see it. And stop. DO probe. Dissolved oxygen. Going into the river. <laughs>